Right, so the internet is filled with people trying to buy and sell stuff and half of them are absolute crackheads. So today we're looking at some of the best and worst of them courtesy of r slash crackhead craigslist. All right, first up, what did I do wrong? Praise spares. Hi, I'd like to buy this. I need to upgrade my goldfish pond. Thank you for your interest. I have a current offer of $100, $120? Only if you're gonna come out today. How long is it? I don't know, cause I might need to rent a car to fit it. How about you fuck off? What did they do to deserve that? They just asked how long it was to see if they could rent the car. Maybe a scammer. Asking for measurements or extra pics often weeds out the fakes because they'll just refuse or get cold feet. Bit of a weird thing to scam someone with though. A pond, a pump and a filter. All right, next up. What did he spend that $30 on? Praise Spez. Another Praise Spez thing. What, what, I mean, what, what exactly does that, does that mean? Praise Spez, Praise Spez. Glory to spares. There's clearly an inside joke going on here and I hope we find out what it is. $70? Okay, can you do 40? You just agreed to 70. Yes, but I don't have the 70 anymore. It's kind of like on FIFA career mode where you offer them a wager or offer a transfer and they just instantly accept like, yeah, we're happy with that. And you're like, I definitely should have gone lower. Someone stole a subway sign. Glory to spares. $580. Jeez. Sometimes I hear stories of people going on nights out and being like, look at this stupid thing I've woken up with, like a road sign or a traffic cone, but I'm never seen a massive subway sign. $580 though, that's a win. With a traffic cone, you're like, why the fuck did I do that? This guy could be half a grand up. Not necessarily stolen, more like a franchise upgrade or out of business. Weird thing to just sell it online and also have it in the middle of the kitchen though, so I don't think I'll buy that. Oh, here we go. I'm getting tired of these praise spares, hail spares, or glory to spares text in the title, as that text means fuck all. I doubt spares even gives a shit. Just being on the website gives him money. Is this Reddit CEO chat? If so, that's so disappointing. Steve Huffman, also known by his Reddit username, Spares is a co-founder and CEO of Reddit. Brilliant. That is so much less cool than I was hoping it was going to be. All right, next up. Ah, yes, just what I was looking for. A thousand dollars of gay Lego. I love Spares. I'm going to stop reading the Spares stuff out now. I know it's the boring CEO. Gay load box full of X Lego. Is this specific Lego like made to like make gay things? Or have Lego just come out with sort of like a pro LGBTQ ad and someone's having a classic hissy fit over it? They probably misspelled Gaylord, which is the term for a large box on a pallet. Oh, so this is a bone apple tea thing. For how long will this work? I don't know why my last post was deleted. The page says no rules. Once again, selling positive pregnancy tests for $50 each. Need money for my kids. Make that man yours forever. That is sick. I don't really get how this works though. Like if you say you're pregnant and your man stays with you, what happens like three months later when no bump arrives? And nine months later when there's no baby, he's gonna be like, right, well, I can leave now, right? Oh my word, good deal. 2023 Mitsubishi F35, 986 grand. Is that actually what that is? Oh my word, Mitsubishi Heavy Unveils Stealth Fighter assembled in Japan. The cost of the F35A has a price tag of around 14 billion yen, $126 million. Yeah, that is insane. Surely that's a troll, but if not, that is the heist of the century. Luxurious room for rent in Ontario. One bed, one bath. Oh, slumming it. $500 a month. Rent is ridiculous. I'm pretty sure serial killers have kept people in basements in better conditions than this. How is that even legal to rent out to someone? Imperial Star Destroyer, Star Wars. Whoa. For free? Surely not. Oh, it's a car that's just added some stuff on the outside. That's so cool. Why are they giving that away for free? This is the sort of thing that I would desperately want. And if I bought within a week, I would regret it. I don't know. Can you imagine the looks you'd get? This is like a proper head turner. Croc Heelys, Creelys, men's size 12. $55, that is a bargain. Is that custom made or is this an actual Crocs thing? That looks like someone's cut it out. Bro, I would literally buy this. Yeah, some of this stuff just is quite cool. What? Okay, this is the kind of stuff that I always thought would be on Craigslist. Free human toilet. Full service human toilet available for use right away. Ability to take and flush down all waste. No limits. Free delivery and install available. Bro, people like this just need serious, serious help. How they even survive one of these experiences I I have no idea. Like, how do you not just die from doing this? Where in your life does it go wrong from you just being like an innocent child to being an adult that does this? Just, it's actually just a little bit sad. Oh my God, do you remember this guy? For context, I don't know if this is just like a British thing, but there was like a very famous GIF meme video going around of this guy, clearly on all sorts. I mean, crack at least. I mean, this guy is peak crackhead, just losing it in the middle of a disco. <laughs>
Gurning Guy Rave action figure for sale. That's so cool. That is ridiculously niche. I need to figure out if you can get these icons because that would be so jokes. Imagine me and all the guys that I make videos with just as little icons. That would bang. If that's the thing I can actually get like made somewhere, I'm so doing that. That's jokes. Waffles. Waffles indeed. $7. I mean, that just is on purpose, isn't it? At least I think that's what they look like. I'll find out someday. Bitch, be gone. Settle down, wine mama. I was going to say, this is such a Facebook mum meme. Like, eliminates hoes. Come on. Free gently used hot dogs. What have they been gently used for? Mm. More. Dog food, maybe. 115 gently used shaboing boings. What's with gently used hot dogs? To be fair, where else can you get 115 gently used shaboing boings for $10? Steal. Even if they have been up an old man's ass. A swinging toilet. This brings me back to the guy who said he was going to be a free toilet. Something makes me think that you're not supposed to plug that into plumbing. And it's been sold. And this was posted four days ago. So it's probably already been in use. I saw that in a video once. Let's just say it was not home improvement related. Yeah, that was my first assumption too. Interesting looking laptop. <laughs> laptop computer it's kind of sad this is like old boomer like they're probably in their final stages i mean goodness knows what their tube is but it's never a good sign and given it's dollars i bet it's america maybe this laptop sale is going towards the healthcare of this poor old dying individual 15 days ago maybe they're already dead holy kiwi fruit that is a good little match current bit of 76 dollars people are so weird bit hairy for my liking i actually found one in the wild free items you might like free knee surgery what the fuck who's this lady oh i see got you that makes sense although free seems like a pretty good deal that's exactly what i was gonna say is there even a market for this what the hell is that this articulated pharaoh hound skeleton was my dog for 10 years before she had a series of strokes she was a part of the family and i loved her dearly but i feel that it's time for her to find a new family why it's not like you're running out of money to feed her or something or you can't take her on walks because your new job's too busy it's a tiny skeleton of your dog who would buy that there's definitely a market for this not sure you're about your location, but a lot of countries have whole communities of people who collect stuff like this. I get if, if it's like something really cool, like dinosaur bones. Nerd! Like if you find a T-Rex bone and you want to keep one of those in your house, fair enough, that's kind of cool. But someone's dead dog skeleton. Weird. Foul mattress, $25. If you type into AI, generate a crack house, this is what you'll find. This mattress belonged to my sister, past tense. She's in jail now for embezzlement at the moment, just trying to clear shit out. She did not wash all that much, so the mattress smells pretty rancid. Kind of like expired eggs. But if you spray some of that Febreze shit on there, it'll probably clean it up nice and get one of them covers and put it on. The mattress is busted down on the left side due to her fat ass. But just use the right. Let me know if you've got any questions. What are half the things in this photo? Why are there four mattresses? Why have they got no covers? Why are they that dirty? All right, things have been getting weirder and I think we've just about reached peak crackhead. So I'm gonna leave it there. If you enjoyed today's video, make sure you leave a like. Let me know in the comments if you enjoyed this and want a part two or if you want me to react to something else or another subreddit and make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss the next one. Thank you for watching. Bye for now.